think if we want the Apollo Championship, we gotta come out and beat Matt Toon. What are you guys preparing for this week? Championship this week. I mean, that's the mentality going into every practice, every day. Uh, it's just another championship. I mean, we've had three of those. This this will be number three. You know, Mount Zion was the first potential one, then Effingham, and then this one's the real deal. So that's the mentality we're bringing into it. Um, after the win last week, obviously you found out after the game. Um, what's gone through your mind this week to get ready for? What you said, it is the championship for the Apollo Conference? Uh, well, definitely just getting the minds right, you know, going into Friday and just getting that big win, doing our jobs. You know, it's probably going to be a little soggy. Yeah, it's been raining all week, so just playing the best football we possibly can. And uh, also, we're kind of rooting for Mount Zion, so. Uh, does it help that this game's at home, and if so, why? Yeah, it does. I mean, those two weeks we were on the road, we went out Mount Zion, got the big win, then Effingham, the disappointment. And then coming home last week, I mean, it feels great. You know, you really, after playing for those guys for three weeks in a row, you start to get used to it. It's so much fun playing for Purple Rank, and it is an advantage. TVI! TVI! Um, a conference title is obviously something that you guys have never experienced in your high school careers. What would that mean for you guys and for this team? And means just about more than anything really. Uh, you know, other than a state championship, conference championship would be awesome to have. Uh, just another memory put on the put on the board. What's gotta happen on Friday night for you guys to achieve that goal? We all gotta come out and execute. Last week, I mean it was almost there every drive, but then one little thing to kill it every time, be it a penalty or a turnover. And we can't have that this week because we know that they're a good team. We just gotta come out and everybody's gotta execute to their fullest and I think we'll come out and win. Uh, a huge part of your guys' offense, obviously last week was Bo, the 39 carries, and everyone knows about Tanner and what he can do. How important is your guys' job on the line when, when you know that those guys are behind you? It's it's really huge, you know. They they count on us to get the job done with the execution and all that. You know, whether it's a click, blob, Dave, or a near release, you know, it's just got to be there and we got to get to the secondary and get it all done. So. Uh, offensively, you know what you got to do. What about what's your defense got to do on Friday in order to uh, for you guys to win the game? Yeah, they're gonna have to squat up again. Every week they come out and they do their job pretty well. I mean, it's ever since like week one, week two, they've been pretty locked down on everybody other than the Effingham slip up. But no fly zones. Pieces gotta... are coming together. No fly zones gonna have to play to their full potential like they did against Mount Zion. And they're gonna have to take away the run, which we've generally been pretty good about doing. Uh, what would you guys tell people who are, aren't sure if they want to come out on Friday night and watch you guys play? Be there, be square, bundle up. It's going to be a good game.